keep it secret, it's a different bills. Hey, don't go dim it, you need it, I got it listed, yeah. You wanna make it, I'll show you just how to make it, yeah. I got all the rarest bills, and I ain't done, yeah. I'm from the finish to making bills like a prospect. Flow space and slashes to catching us with a lot threat. You keep the medals, cause the real ones coming up next. Only scratch the surface, still they try to drag my name in dirt, they try to bring me down. See me when you and Yo, what's good, my nephews and nieces? This is your favorite uncle, Uncle Demi, and today I have another special banger for you, all right? Today we have the replica build of Robert Horry, aka Big Shot. But before we get into the video, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. It's liking up the video, push the video to the recommended, and of course, subscribe and put your noti game for my daily double uploads. But now let's hop straight into this video, okay? So we finally got Big Shot in there, man. We, you know, we know we listen, we got his green animation in the game. I'm a diehard Laker fan, I know exactly what he did for me. And my Lakers back in the early 2000s. But again, this version is going to be of the San Antonio Spurs version because it's probably going to be the best version. Um, but again, he's a small forward. He's right handed. He's number five. Um, we're going to go 6'10 with this. So this is dope. We get to go 6'10 with this build. 225 pounds. Get your wingspan down to 6'11. And then body shape. I went to fine, but you can go any body shape that you want to, okay? Um, and then the good thing is we are able to get a really high close shot with this build So again, this will be associated to a post hook, but it's also going to allow you to get the fearless finisher um, That's gonna be really important the driving layup is a 78 But really all we really care about is just the um, big man layup package You better get that because he is 610 so you do but you have a 78 driving layup um, And then the driving dunk is only a 68. So there's nothing crazy there All you all you're only able to get a 68, but his standing dunk is a 93. All right, so that's very important to have a 93 standing dunk because that's gonna allow you to get those area wizard on hall of fame so when you are going back door or picking and rolling going to the basket for the lobs you're able to do that and he does have a respectable 73 post control so again you're going to be able to do a lot more than what he usually does robert horry you know do well in his prime like when he was with the rockets robert horry did a lot of things you know what i'm saying but the robert horry that most of us remember because you know obviously you know <laughs> we weren't we weren't old enough back then um, like for me, my Lakers, like he was a spot up, like Robert, Robert, he was a spot up, man. You know, he spot up, he shot his threes. He did what he did. He was, he just played a good role and played some solid defense, but he was a good role player. He has a lot of rings, by the way, too. Let's not get it twisted. My man got a lot of rings. I think he had like seven um, yeah, seven or six. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure someone in the comment section will correct me. But, um, cause he won, obviously he won with the Lakers. He won with the Rockets. He won with the Spurs. Like he did everywhere he went. He won, man. So that's it. That's what role players do. Great ones. We go 81 in the mid range shot. Um, you want to get that mini position, of course. You get that space creator because you will be able to use this build more so as a post score if you wanted to. But this is where things get beautiful. A 93 ball. So that will be able to get you Claymore Hall of Fame. You will be able to get catch and shoot and blinders on gold. You're right. Corner specials Hall of Fame. You even get aging threes like gold green machine. So again, like there's a lot of good things you, you can um, like about this because it can flat out shoot. This is one of the good spot up builds because with your spot up, you want them to be able to shoot. You want them to be able to be reliable getting rebounds and putting it back up. Obviously, standing dunk with elite big man contact dunks is going to be insane. Um, he will have a 63 pass accuracy. That's as only as high as you can go. But you are able to get break starter on Brian. So if you did want to use this build as a power forward in rec, not a center, but as a power forward, this would be a good one. All right. Um, and then a funny thing is you do get a 72 ball handle with this. So you are able to actually dribble a little bit with this build. 44 speed with ball you have eight bash points total but there's nothing really to worry about usually this build in my opinion would be good for the twos the threes in the park or the four in the rack okay um and then of course here this is where the versatility is at a 76 interior defense and a 76 perimeter so again you are, you are able to play in interior and on the perimeter pretty well the 76 perimeter defense is also associated with lateral quickness so you have a 76 lateral quickness um you have a 74 steel you only have a 68 block so again that's something that's a little bit like well you know i wish it could be higher because you want to get anchor but at the same time you do get silver chase down for this build 77 on the offensive rebound okay and then you only get an 80 on the defensive so you're only able to get bronze rebound chasing with this build so just keep that in mind but at the same time look at this defense all the way around it's just above average in every single category so what that means is is that you should be able to play pretty solid especially if you're a good player if you're a good player and you want to be called big shot and you want to be a spot up have some fun with a replica build this is going to be one that you're going to like put the green animation of his build on it too so you know when you hit that shot and you get to do the you know big shot um bob um animation when you hit when you get a green i think that's pretty dope 63 speed and acceleration only 68 on the strength 
um you want to go on your vert 75 so you're able to get all those elite dunk packages and of course 90 on that stamina so what you're looking at is 24 i mean 22 24 20 um, 8 21 so finishing shooting and defense is actually like in the 20s which is insane and then you have the eight playmaking which you're not really worrying about again like that's just not going to be this build's avenue okay so all in all like i said it's a really solid build i mean it's a solid spot up moment this is a spot up right this ain't meant to be anything else other than a spot up right um then you have options here you have shot creating you have sharp you have lock and you have glass okay so there is some avenues a way to do this um you know from my opinion you know as a spot up i think that should be the first one as your spot up um have that as you take limitless range if you wanted to but in, in, in most cases maybe going perimeter badge drop or going something with like um box out or you know if you're playing rec maybe going glass clearing dimes i mean there's so many different options here but for the most part i'm just going to go with the two shooting badges okay so that's what i'm gonna rock with and then of course here you have it my nephews and nieces what we all been waiting for <laughs> all right robert ori and um you know what i'm saying like wait, listen man it's robert Horry, man like come on bro like come on man like as a lakers fan this is what i need like even look at this is the spurs run but you see the championship on this jersey i mean like this big shot man like this man wins wherever he went man so again man shout out to him so now we're doing this we'll test the build out real quick we'll get a 99 of course we'll then get you out of here so let's go ahead and max this out here boom all right um now we're gonna go here again fearless finisher you want to get your aerial wizard at least on gold, so that's your 10. Down here, you have the option for rise up. We're going to core rise up. I think that's important. We'll also get fast twitch. Again, being able to get these ba um, these badges down here is going to be very important as far as finishing at the basket. With that last little bit, go ahead and put your post band technician on because remember, you can't work in that post. I think that's going to be pretty good to have. And then I drop in bronze slithery. So again, everything that you'll want with this, you're going to have, which is pretty dope. Don't worry about limitless. Don't worry about masher, none of that. All these badges here is what's really going to work with you. On the shooting side, of course, you want to go here. And then maybe we can go corner specials also here, even though it's corner specials is not as um, great this year. But it's still a hey, still good enough to have, right? Core catch and shoot. Go ahead and get blinders. Um, you have dead eye. I'll go ahead and get blue dead eye also. Um, and then with that last little bit, bad, bonk it. Let's go Hall of Fame. Like, this is go all out. Up here, if you're going to be working in the post, maybe go space crate and all that. But for the most part, you should be good here. No, I am tripping. Hold up claymore boom all right that's what we want let's take um yeah let's do that claymore i'm tripping corner specialist let's just get that let's take that eye off we don't want that and then let's get corner specialist this right here i like better i actually like this better now all right and then let's just get clutch let me see which one clutch shooter is doing fourth quarter or overtime now nah, let's just do come at kid if you're down get some big shots there so yeah let's do that come on it's big shot right um here what i'll do is again i'll core vice grip um, let's get quick first step. Let's get break starter. And then I would go with, let's go with um, special delivery. All right, nothing crazy here. No more about that. Down here, though, you got to get your box out. You got to get your chase down. That's four. Let's go here. So that's 10. Down here, we'll go record this. And then brick wall, pogo stick. Let's go here. Uh, let's get menace. Let's get glove. Let's get interceptor. Let's get all these badges here, man. Um, let's see what challenger. Boom. Um, your spot up. So ain't really much left. Uh, I guess we can go post lockdown. <laughs> uh, and pick dodger. I mean, shoot, this is to throw it all in there, man. <laughs> so yeah, cause you have so much. But yeah, man. So that you already see, man. There's so many different badges you can get. Remember, and I still didn't talk about double coring. Or I didn't still. If you wanted to double core, obviously you can't get enough shooting. So I would definitely double core here. If you double core here, you'll be able to get your, your green, um, your dead eye. So I think double coring here, and then add on your badge points, get as much shooting badge as possible, would be the smart route. But again, it's your build. You can do it any way you want to. But yeah, let me know in the comment section what you think about this big shot, Bob. I'm sorry, with this case, it's just big shot. What do you think about this build? Let me know in the comment section. But other than that, it's your favorite old head, Uncle Demi. I'll be back really, really soon with another banger, man. You know, when I say back to another banger, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm talking about tomorrow, man. I'm out.